I've spent over 50 years photographing trees in the Australian bush and uh, I've learnt over those years, through my connection with trees, uh, how nature works. My time in nature has not only developed my resilience, it's saved my life. Grit is about determination and resilience. The beautiful gum tree against the heavily textured wall of Ormiston Gorge. I see that tree as being a survivor. We need to help children connect with nature so that they can learn this as well. Staying the course regardless of difficulty. There's a difference between seeing and feeling. You know, we see a tree, we see texture, we see uh, a bestilled lake. We see these things, but we also feel emotion. And I think that now, more than ever, we need to develop emotional intelligence, empathy, and understanding for each other. This is no sort of greater learning. You don't have to go to university to do this. But you do have to be still, you do have to be present, and be prepared to be inquiring. To learn problem solving from nature is enormously powerful. A Malaluka growing horizontally to the ground, heavy, freezing cold wind blowing. So what does the tree do? It grows horizontally. The flaming sun rising over a large flock of budgerigars. So many budgerigars, not enough trees, not enough hollows nesting on the ground. N nature just gets on with it. One of the very powerful connecting methods for children is, is physicality physically getting them out of the classroom uh, and I think tree planting is a fantastic way. National Tree Day I think is the most important celebratory day of the year. This is Australian Tree Day. This is an opportunity for people uh, to express their, their, their connection and love for nature.